Hi guys, it's Mina, and today in this video I'm going to talk about my top 10 Berenstain Bears books. Now, I love the Berenstain Bears. I used to read their books all the time when I was a kid. I used to get one from the live, get a book from the library all the time. I just loved reading them so much, and I used to buy them at the bookstore and stuff like that. I actually have several Berenstain Bears books. But, well, I think I do have several Bernstein, Berenstain Bears books, but I don't think I have them anymore. And I used to read them all the time when I was a kid. I used to look at the books. Even I, they were read at my daycare all the time. Time. And if you guys have any favorite Berenstain Bear books, let me know down in the comments below. And I'm going to get started. Number one on my list had to be the Berenstain Bears and the New Baby. Now, I like this one because this is about... About Mama and Papa having a new baby, and it's actually sister, and brother is a big brother now, which is pretty cool. Cool, and he learns the responsibilities of being a big brother, brother and having a little sister. Number two on my list would have to be the Berenstain Bears and the Bad Dream. Now, in this one, the brother is obsessed with these toys. I forgot what they're called. They're like weird-looking alien bear toys. And he sees this movie, and then after as he sees the movie, he has a really bad dream about... After you see, so he sees this movie that are based on the toys, that is based on the toys, but after he sees the movie, he starts to have a bad dream. Dream about, about like, the bear things, the space bears or whatever they're called. I don't remember what they're called. Called and they're not as scary. Uh, they're as scary, scarier than he thought they were. Number three, my list has to be the Berenstain Bears learn about strangers. In this one, sister learns about not to talk to strangers and not to trust a stranger when it comes to certain things. Things like getting candy, going anywhere with strangers, and stuff like that. And that's a great less. This is a great book for kids because some kid, little kids, don't know anything about going anywhere with strangers. Strangers, like, they, some kid, little kids don't know anything about, like, they shouldn't be going anywhere with strangers, that they shouldn't be getting candy from strangers and stuff like that. I think this is a great book for kids to learn about safety. Number four, I'm going to to be the Berenstain Bears, No Girls Allowed. I like this one because sister is, like, gets better at her brother, gets better than her brother and her friends. I mean, and his friends at certain things, and then once they become more jealous of her accomplishments, they don't allow her to hang out with them. Number five on my list would have to be the Berenstain Bears and the Trouble with Friends. I like this one because sister makes a new friend, and as she and her friend are playing along, they kind of like start to be mean to each other, each other, and then kind of pick on each other, and then fight. Fight, but then they learn a lesson about making up. Number six on my list would have to be the Berenstain Bears and the Bully. And this one, sister is beaten up by this bully who... Bully, and then the, um... And then she learns how to defend herself with the help of her brother. Brother, and she teaches the bully a lesson. Number seven on my list would have to be the Berenstain Bears go to school. I like this one because sister is starting her first time at school and she learns about... Learns about how school is and learning and stuff and how learning is fun. Number eight on my list would have to be the Berenstain Bears and the Trouble with Pets. I like this one because because the Bear family gets a dog and then they learn the responsibilities of being a pet, like being careful of not leaving stuff out that the dog could get or the dog or remembering to feed the dog and taking care of the dog, cleaning up after the dog. Number nine on my list would have to be the Berenstain Bears go to the dentist. I like this one because sister is go has her first sister has her first dentist appointment, and then she and brother go to, and then she learns about what the dentist does and the tools that the dentist use and stuff like that. And then she ha also has a loose tooth, and then she ends up getting it pulled out at the dentist. Number ten on my list would have to be the Berenstain Bears in the messy room. I like this one because. Brother and sister have such a messy room that their mom gets tired. So that's their messy room, and then mo the mom is, like, super tired of the messy room. So they try their best to keep the room nice and clean. Nice and clean, and they all work together. Okay, so those are my top ten Berenstain Bears books. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in another video soon. Bye!